Hey everyone, welcome back to Style by Us. Today, for your DIY Makeshift Monday, I have a super fun dorm project again that is just going to help you learn how to use your space effectively. So in dorms, you're in a small confined space and we normally have a lot of stuff, especially as girls. We just have way too much stuff. But I have some really great tips and tricks that I'm gonna share with you today to help use your space in the best way that you can. But while you're at university, storage is a huge problem. So I found that my trolley cart or storage cart was a huge help in my room. You can get these in a variety of different colors and sizes and shapes. Whatever you're looking for, I'm sure they have it out there. I got this room from Ikea and it came in about three different colors. I got gray because it was the only one left. I wanted to get a white one, but unfortunately they were sold out. So I went with this one and I actually didn't mind it too much because it allowed what I was featuring on my cart to really showcase in my room. And if you really don't like the color, you can always spray paint it. Check last week's spray painting Monday video um, and you can see how we changed some of the dorm storage to look really cute. But anyway, I'm going to show you three different ways that you can use a cart, trolley cart in your room and optimize it for the best storage and to feature some of your fun products. So this one is going to be focused on beauty, toiletries and kind of showcasing some of your beautiful products. So on the top compartment here, I have my makeup. So I have my Sparkle Everyday Makeup Brush Holder and with all of my lovely SL Miss Glam brushes inside. And then I have my pink SL Miss Glam lashes in the top here as well. I love pink, so featuring lots of pink on the front here is great. I also have my SL Miss Glam Beauty Blender. Love it. <laughs> And then also you can feature lots of palettes that are so beautiful because they have some really gorgeous palettes out there. Like the Jaclyn Hill and Becca collaboration palettes. They're white and gold that are just like my theme. So I love to keep those in here. Then I've got some other palettes and some powders. And then you can also buy some makeup organizers right here. And you can fill it with your makeup products and there's so many different shapes and sizes and compartments that you can buy that you can fill the top here with all of your makeup and you're good to go. Now, the only thing I do wanna say is just be careful where you're keeping your brushes if they're gonna be in a dusty area or where, where you can get some dirt and dust on them. Maybe have a little cover that can go on top of it and just remember to regularly clean your brushes. The second compartment here is for accessories. So I wanted some space to showcase some of the beautiful necklaces, bracelets, sunglasses, really anything that you wanna show off in your dorm room. So I like to keep the jewelry boxes that you get when you're buying your jewelry and they make great storage containers. So then you have this, if you're traveling, it's perfect and you know your jewelry is in a safe place. I also like to keep them in the boxes because if you have all your jewelry laying out um, all the time, it can tarnish, it can get some dust on it, it can get dirty. So you wanna make sure you're keeping your jewelry nice and clean. You can also display some phone cases in here. And phone, case, phone cases are so colorful and bright that you can really make like a piece of art just from your phone cases. So always keep that in mind if you wanna brighten up your room. I like to keep my wrap bracelets in the bottom here. And then I also keep some sunglasses in here as well. And then I always know them. And when you have your things on display, you're more likely to use them. So I always like to keep that in mind. And then on the bottom tier here, I have all my hair products. So the biggest thing is that if you are gonna use hair as one of these bins, make sure it's on the bottom because if you have products and things like that, you don't want them leaking on your jewelry or on your makeup, that's a disaster. If it leaks on the carpet, you can clean the carpet. But uh, make sure you're not putting this above anything else that if it does get leaked on, it'll get ruined. So I have my products on the side, the tools on top, and then I have a compartment down here with hairbrushes, um, elastics, bobby pins, and things like that. So that is one way you can style a um, dorm cart and use it to show off some of your beautiful products. So another way that you can style your trolley cart is with your electronics. So for me, that is lots of cameras and extra wires and cords and things like that. So having it all in one place that can roll around the room is kind of great for me. So on the top, I like to have all my camera stuff so it's on display and it is constantly reminding me to always grab my camera, use it, and bring it with me. So I have 
my main body here. I have some of my lenses. I've got a Instax instant film camera. I have the GoPro right here. Um, the drone would not go on here as that would go in its carrying case somewhere else. <laughs> um, but to, I just keep my main basics up on the top here and then also my photography business cards in case I'm going out to work with clients, make sure I have everything and I can also see what I've got at all times. The second level um, is just some more equipment. So I've got my Kindle, we have an iPad, and then I also have my computer down here right now. Probably you would keep your computer on your desk, but um, if you wanted to clean it up or you're using your desk for something else, great place to store it. And then I also keep my laptop cover in the bottom of this as well. And then on the bottom one here, I just have some external hard drives here that I have. I have three right now going, so it's always nice to know where they are. And then I've got some extra cords and I have my headphones. So never want to lose your headphones, so keep them where you know they're going to be. So I like to keep that here. You could also keep any other charging cords that you need to have but don't need plugged in all the time. Keep them down here and that would be perfect. You can really style this any way you want with your electronics, but this is just how I thought it would be best used. Now for the last and final way I'm going to show you how to style your trolley. I did this last year and it was a little bit different because my Keurig that I used is already back at school, so I'll be sure to take a picture and share it with you what my tea cart looks like at school. And it's definitely a bit toned down as this was completely full this was overblown with the amount of tea I had, so I toned it down to look a bit nicer for you guys. But this is essentially your tea or coffee cart. And I am obsessed with tea and it is relaxing, calming, and de-stressing for me, so it was a big thing to have in my room. I absolutely loved having a tea cart and it allowed me to have my Keurig wherever I needed it. It didn't have to be in the way, I could just roll it away when I didn't want it. So it worked out well. On the top, I put my actual Keurig, but my Keurig was white and it was also a smaller version, so it fit a lot better onto here. And I also kept a bowl of sugar and normally a serving spoon on the top. The middle shelf holds all of my teas, whether that's loose leaf or a tea bag. I keep them all together here and I would try to put them in a somewhat pleasing order so that it uh, is exciting to pick what kind of tea I'm going to have. And then on the bottom, I would have all my teacups. Now I also included my travel mugs, so it got pretty jam-packed down here, but um, half and half are, some are at school and some are still here, so I put a few down here for you guys to see, um, but you can fill it up with whatever you're gonna use to hold your tea. And having the travel mugs was super handy down here, so they're just out of the way and you don't have to worry about them. So this is, my favorite way to use a tea cart or a trolley in your room and um, let me know what you think. Let me know if you have any other ideas. If you would style your trolley cart a different way, let me know. I would love to hear and I would love to see pictures of how you use it in your dorm room. So make sure to send those over to me. Let me know what you think. I hope you guys enjoyed this little DIY Monday. It's a lot easier. It's more about styling than uh, doing it yourself. but. You are doing it yourself. So let me know what you guys think. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and um, I will catch you guys in my next post. So have an awesome day and I'll see you later. Bye guys.